trying this for the first time with this new logging equipment stuff, but uh, ordered this knife. I don't read reviews, I don't read anything about them. I see something that I might use, I order. Not sure what the little confetti business is, but whatever. Uh, I have already pulled it out, tried it out a couple times, looked at it. Uh, one of the things I found really weird when I first did it was how do I change this thing if I don't want it to sit on my belt like that. So, pain in the butt getting this off because this was really tight, but once I finally popped that loose, then it worked. Then squeeze on these sides, lift it up. Of course, this is where you can uh, change where, the, where that daggone belt is, which is also a pain as far as I'm concerned. Popping it off, putting it back in, whatever. I just found it a pain. You know, if you're going to have all these little slides and all these little twists, go ahead. The more you use that, the more you change that, of course, the more it's going to wear and then finally it's going to break. So, notice the that it will turn around and you can take these little clips off, unscrew these, guess I should have done this quicker, should have had this all set up, like I said this is the first time so you all are having to deal with me doing this for my first time, but hopefully as I get used to this, figure out what I'm doing, that uh, we'll be able to I would get better at this. And so if you want your want it sideways, you'll be able to put that in there sideways, moving that, pop that out, push it in here. I know some people like to to have their knives sideways. I'm not one. But they do pop in. And then you close it up, fasten to your belt. So it's sitting that way or that way I guess is what you want so anyway that's a nice little feature that uh, you're not going to find every day uh, this is how it was received uh, I would run these through these little holes here tie this back up because this paracord is just going to come loose and uh, just going to start unraveling Nice and tight fit. I'm not going to be worrying about that thing falling out. Not until after it gets a lot of use. Uh, it's rated here. I have not tried it. It is oiled. I have not tried it on wood to see if it actually saw wood. I would be surprised. It does feel fairly sharp. I sharpen all my own knives. This looks like it's uh, 10, 20. Probably 20 angle. It says it's 420 uh, steel. It's not marked. It's got a little cute little thing there. But as usual, I always grab a piece of paper. I try to hold it steady and cut sharp. Uh, nice piece of steel, like I said. So I'm not uh, real concerned about it. I'll probably end up going up to a uh, 30 degree bevel. I see that little tip. You can see how fine that tip is. Me out in the woods, when I need it for something, I can see me chipping that deck on thing. But otherwise, pretty nice. Well worth the money. And uh, we'll see how it stands up when it actually gets out into the field. See if this paracord works for me. Uh, at 6'2", maybe my hands are a little bit bigger than others. I like to have a grip. I don't like my fingers all bunched up. So a little bit tight for me. But uh, I'm not going to war out in the field. So anyway, just my opinion. Otherwise, I think it's a good deal. I recommend it.